Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play New Horizons. Last time we began to head towards Zip Hangu as we found out that that's where Pietro is and um, he's got our money. So, I am, if you remember, I'm now in the port of Valparaiso and it's a supply port. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you, in my opinion, the fastest way to get to Zip Hangu. Now, if you were going for fame and adventure, what you would do is you'd go up the coast there and find some villages um, <clears throat> in order to get some more fame. And, but we're not going to do that. From Valparaiso, we're going to head directly west. And you're gonna, it's, it's going to take a little while, but fortunately I have turbo mode, so we can speed past this. Now, right there, sometimes you can get uh, those of you that are looking for fame. There's a star level discovery right there. That's the Moa, Moai, I believe. And it's a star level discovery, even though you can plainly see this right there on the island. But um, the game didn't spawn at this time. So from there, we're going to go directly to the northwest. The reason I like doing this route is because there's landmarks along the way. Like here we are, here's the port of Tahiti. So if we run into trouble, we can just um, you know, do a, we can just reload on food and water there. And we're to continue to travel to the northwest. There's the path, the path that we're taking on the map, so you can kind of see it there. And uh, we're heading up this way. Continuing to head up. Hopefully I don't run into a storm, or if I do run into a storm, they'll actually alert me when I'm going to run into a storm. So moving along, moving along. Oh, and of course they decided not to do that. Ugh, my chief navigator sucks. I need to get a new one. Oh well. Okay, so fortunately we're going to use our bomb. And uh, we'll take care of that. I thought I was going to, I thought I was going to make it, but... Turns out I didn't. Oh well. Okay, need to repair my ships. Good. 31 planks of lumber. Okay, no problem. I'll just, uh... That's alright. I'll just kill a guy and get some new lumber. So, but, here we are, folks. We're here in the land of Japan, actually. And this is the land of Zipangu. So, we're gonna head over this way. Start to explore. And there's one of the best ports in the game. There's the port of Sakai. Let's go ahead and stop here. We'll, of course, wait and stop during the day. Here we go. Yes. And you can tell that our guys are getting strong because we were at sale for quite a few days, but didn't get any level ups. Okay. Love the music here. Really um, captures the spirit of this part of the world, I think, anyways. So, okay. First place we want to go is go to the shipyard and see if we can find Pietro. And do you know of him? Nope, never heard of him. Shoot, he must not be here. But, okay, look at our fame and trade now. And we're definitely going to do some investing. Now, in these ports here in Zipangu, you definitely want to invest 50000 Okay. Now, another 800 fame and trade, that's a good thing. Now, let's go up to the marketplace. Because you also want to invest a thousand or 50000 into the market. Because you want to get this port up to um, 1000 to and 1000 in each as quickly as possible. Okay, let's see if this guy's seen Pietro. Nope, never heard of him. Shoot. All right. But we're going to invest here, too. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, good. Now, well, let's go to the cafe. See if we can find him or find any information, because the cafe always seems to know everything. There's usually somebody that knows everything. Hey, there's Pietro. He's right there. Do we know Adventure by Pietro? We've got a visitor. Well, hey, that was easy. Cool. We found him. Did we come all the way just to collect payment on the loans? My purse is still full. Well, that's good to know. Ten gold ingots at ten times. Plus an interest, of course. Yes. There we go. Very cool. Awesome. We got our money back. Yay, that's exciting. All right. Oh, we are all, yeah, okay. We're also here to collect the debt on Marco Polo Bank's investment. Okay, great. Hey, Two hundred gold ingots. Here comes the money. Here we go. Money talk. Here comes the money. Money, money, money. <laughs> dollar, 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 dollar. Whoa, that's a lot of money. Look at this, it's just going, it's going, it's going. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. There's only one thing that we can say right now. Show me the money. 
Yeah, there you go. Wow. It's unfortunate that we have to pay this money back, but hey, just kidding. Wow. Aren't you paying me too much? Shh, shh, Ali, don't jinx it. He only borrowed 20 gold ingots, but I like to return 10 times the original amount. Wow. Your accounts are seven. Hmm, yes, this is the golden country of Zipangu. Hmm, yes, silver is cheap down in Nagasaki. We'll head over there. Hmm, El Dorado, the legendary city of gold. Hmm. Everything from the buildings and the teaspoons are made to pure gold. Ooh, we gotta find that port. Ooh, gold medallion, that's nice. Does El Dorado really exist? Man, I hope so. He'll find it. Pietro's an amazing adventure. South America. Good call. And that also gives us a clue for what to do in Pietro's scenario, so. Wow, that's cool. Well, man, we got a ton of money. Yeah, <laughs> I like it. I like it. But we're not done here in... Uh, we're definitely not done here in Zipangu. We're going to uh, start by heading over to the port of Nagasaki. Do the slow walk here. Yeah, we could do it quickly. Oh, the king's looking for us. Okay, that's cool. Um, yeah, we could do it quickly, but yeah, I'm not going to do that. Nope, we're not going to do that yet because there's a couple more ports that I want to invest in while we're here. Okay, now we're going to head over here to the port of Nagasaki. As mentioned before, silver is really cheap here, so I'm going to show you a quick little trade route. <clears throat> Excuse me. And we'll wait till the daytime. Yeah, we're also going to want to invest 50000 here. Um, another neutral port. Absolutely. So, first place we need to go is the shipyard. It's not as strong, so we're not going to get as, as much fame and trade, but very few port or very few sailors are going to come out this far to invest um, in these ports. So, uh, it's okay for us to definitely invest and, um, uh, you know, kind of pour a lot of money into it because there's chances are they're not going to be taken back. And we really don't want to come out this far again, except to perhaps pick up our ships. Um, that we're going to be purchasing, hopefully. Well, you know, at this point of the game, we might not even need them. But we'll see. If I need to do some investing out here, then, you know, I will. But, um, okay. Oops, oh, shoot, sorry, I forgot to show you the goods that you can buy here. No, we're not going to get the money back to Venice just yet. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to go up in here. I definitely want to show you this because I'm actually going to purchase some. So check this out. Buy goods. Oh, shoot. Tax-free permits expired. Okay, maybe we do need to go back to Europe. But look at that. 42 gold pieces for silver. That's awesome. And we only want to pay 10. Yeah, 25 gold pieces for silver. We can turn around and sell it for, well, a decent amount. So check this out. So we buy this there. And now what we're going to do is we're going to head back to the port of Sakai, and we're going to sell it. After we do the slow walk, and let's get this money back to Venice. Now we have time. Okay, am I going to make it? No, nah, I better resupply just to be sure. Okay, so you guys remember how to get to Sakai. I'll meet you there. Okay, folks, we made it to the port of Sakai, okay? And I just want to show you this real fast, um, just the potential of money that can be made in this area. Um, so we're going to sell our goods. I believe we bought them for 15, and we're selling them for 208. So that's almost 15 times um, the investment that we made there. We made our money back for investing in the port. So um, this is a that's a perfect way to just to make some money just because of the investing that we're going to do. So I could buy some more goods, but I'm going to wait just a little bit because there's one more port that I want to show you uh, before I run out of time. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to head down to the port. Well, I'll show you. I'll surprise you. But anyways, what you do is just head to the southwest. And we're just going to mosey along here. And if you head to the southwest general area. Oops, I missed it. There it is. This is the port of Zaiton. And I definitely want to stop here. The reason that we want to stop here is a couple reasons. One is um, because it's a strong port. It's neutral. 
so we can invest in it quickly and get some more fame and trade. The other reason is that they also sell balm here. So, but it turns, turns out I'm out of time, so off screen, I'll um, invest in this port, get it on our side, and I'll purchase some more balm as well. But until then, until the next time we're together, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.